Good. Great. Well, how about that? How about Dylan coming through? I mean, you pitched a great game, and for him to kind of come through and get you there. The yeah. Inning, how cool was that? Uh, yeah, that was huge. You know, Jeff threw, you know, a heck of a game. He battled out there just like we knew he would. Um, and, you know, we just had to stick to the game plan, and then, uh, you know, Garrett came in. Um, and, you know, we had some good ABs before him and then put him in a big situation. And, you know, big-time players make big-time plays, and that's exactly what he did, putting a ball in right center and, uh, you know, just kind of gave us that momentum that we were looking for all game, just that one big hit, and finally the guards got stuff going. So, yeah, that was huge. Second, well, well, the second inning, you know, bases loaded, go three out of pain, and you kind of come back, get out of that, and, mm -hmm. and just really limited to one run. How big was that for you to kind of get out of there and then make those pitches right there? Yeah, exactly. I just stepped off the mound and kind of said, you know, just take it one pitch at a time, uh, you know, can't get out of it, and just one pitch here with 3-0. So after, you know, throw a strike there because it's not going to be swinging. So, um, you know, just one pitch at a time. And like you said, I was able to battle back and, um, you know, that could be a turning point in the game right there. If they, you know, get a double in the gap or something or give up a hit and, uh, you know, so I just told myself battle, you know, as hard as you can and uh, let the defense work and, you know, end up working out for our favor. Watching that eighth inning from the dugout, what was kind of going through your mind, seeing them kind of take some pressure off you and some much? Yeah, that was awesome. I knew, you know, I knew we were battling all game and, uh, you know, just waiting for that one big hit. And like I said, Dylan finally came up. Um, and, you know, just telling myself to stay locked in like I was all game. You know, once you get a three-run lead, you can't get comfortable, especially with a great team like that. You know, they get runners on base, and they can do some tricky stuff to, you know, get stuff going a little bit. So I just had to stay locked in and, um, you know, just made a bad pitch to there to Packard, and he made me pay for it, just like good hitters do. So. Did you get to say anything to Dylan or, or uh, Hamilton after yeah. during the game? Oh, my gosh, that was huge. Right when he came in, I gave him, I think, the biggest hug I've ever given in my life. So that was Dylan. huge for them. Yeah, to Dylan and, and Hammy, too. That was big for, you know, a freshman in his first Civil War series. That was, I think, big for him and his confidence after the night he had last night. Uh, what was it about your team to kind of bounce back like this in terms of team building to kind of band up that age? Yeah, absolutely. You know, like I said, Jeff battled all game. Um, and, you know, our energy in the dugout, you know, we kept telling ourselves to keep up the energy. We're going to get that one opportunity and just need someone to come up with a big hit. Uh, and, you know, we had, you know, part of our order come up when we needed them to, and they did exactly what, you know, what they need to. So that was huge for us. And uh, obviously Scotty coming in in a sticky situation there and getting out of it was, you know, huge for, huge for the win. Thanks, man. Awesome. Thank you.